British police surrounded a number of protesters in front of the British Prime Minister's building to prevent them from blocking the convoy of Bahrain's Crown Prince Salman Al Khalifa as he entered the building. But the cheers of the activists were clearly heard as Salman Al Khalifa shook hands with his counterpart Boris Johnson in front of the cameras before they entered the 10 Downing Street building. The activists' protests lasted for more than two hours with the police deliberately obstructing their protest to prevent them from intercepting Salman Al Khalifa's car. The director of the Bahrain Institute for Rights and Democracy, Sayyid Ahmed Al Wadi, said that this meeting is being held in light of the poor conditions inside prisons, expressing his regret that economic interests take precedence over human rights. Activist Ali Mushema said, as activists, they will spare no effort to raise the voice against tyranny and in solidarity with political prisoners, adding that on a personal level, he will travel everywhere to defend the freedom of his father, Professor Hassan Mushema who is deprived of health care.